Alright, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Demon Slayer Season 3, Episode 2. In the last episode, what a cinematic masterpiece that was. Um, it was a two-episode length episode, it was very good. Um, visuals were amazing, we were introduced to all the full top five upper moons. Um, we also got led to the Sword Village. We also saw an, uh, a kind of backstory between the presumably the upper one uh, well, now the current upper one, and someone who's who I thought was Tendro's dad, but apparently a lot of other reactors and anime only thought that as well. But apparently, it's one. It's just Tendro's ancestor, so not not his dad. Uh, someone older than that, presumably. Um, but yeah, uh, very much looking forward to this episode. So as always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. What the fuck? It's like a robot or a doll, what? Yeah, he's just gonna smack a kid, Mr. Miss Hashira. Don't be mean to this kid, you've met me before. Oh, he's strong as shit. He's a Hashira, bro. Damn, boy. Damn, this boy's kind of a bitch. Yeah, it is. Allow it. Yorochi Type Zero. Interesting. He got away. Good job, kid. Oh, he's there. What key? What is he talking about? Yeah, he said you're gonna torture a kid. Okay, there better be a damn good reason for him, like, fucking around with this kid. You don't have to be a dick about it, no matter what it is you actually need from him. Is all you're good for? Fuck off. Remember your place? Bro. <laughs> Let's go, Tanjiro. Yeah, for sure. You wouldn't be able to fight these demons without them. Oh, this is bro that's uh, making Tanjiro's sword, right? Boy! You're an asshole. Seriously. Yeah, he's gonna run away because you owe him a sword. <laughs> Why did he wake up like Nezuko? What was the key for? Was the key for that robot looking thing maybe? Because it, it doesn't look like it's here anymore. What's a doll for? Like a training doll or something? Wow, yeah. Hella crazy training doll. Built by your ancestors? So it's probably impossible to make a new one, or...? That's fucking crazy. Wow. Yeah, because maybe the hair and the earrings. Wow. 300 years ago? What is power in that thing? The technology is crazy, especially in their time. Who in the fuck is this? Yeah! <laughs> this is the crow? Well, yeah, he bite my face! That crow's voice fucking annoys me. <laughs> There's something wrong with me? Oh, Tanjiro. Yeah? Memories, are, uh, inherited memories are just a normal thing. You're a crow, shut your mouth. Shut your beak. <laughs> oh no, he broke it. Is he going to show his face? Would this be like this first person from the swordsmith village whose face we've seen? 
That's poor kid, man. What? Yeah, you're gonna flick him? Why are you hanging from a tree like that? So effort effortlessly hanging from the tree as well. I wonder if they all have those uh, like rosy cheek uh, marks on their cheek. Let's go, Sandro, the motivational speech. Why can't we see their like their face or their eyes? What's the reason for this? What? Is he done already? What is with this kid? Why do you not remember anything? Why do, I, why do your eyes look so dead? Yeah! Wait, this is a Hashira sword? Aren't these more special than just the, the regular swords? <laughs> it's just oozing spite. Oh no. That thing's gotta be heavy as shit as well. How are you gonna get back that back to the village? Ooh. Let's go. Ooh shit! That was hard. <laughs> nice. Anjo is gonna fight with this thing, that's cool. <laughs> right now, in the rain? So it's, it's like he's fighting something that's as strong as the um, the Opal One right now, but it's obviously a bit broken, a bit old as well. It's also not going to go for the kill like the Opal One would. Yeah, kid. Wow. It's definitely downgraded a lot, to be fair. Like that speed probably doesn't match the swordsman, the swordsman when he was, you know, in his prime. Yeah, I'm be honest, Tanjiro. Come on, you need you should be able to body this thing. This kid is a professional shit talker. <laughs> Poor Tanjiro. Oh shit! Yeah, on his head. Day five. He has not food in five days. Are you serious? So he's he's training him like right now, like he's not human. Oh my god, his face and water too. <laughs> oh, poor Tanjiro, man. Bro, his arms look big. Oh, is he passed out? He's dead. Rest in peace. <laughs> oh no. What the hell is this? <laughs> While being massaged. What the hell is it? Damn, he can predict where these are going to hit? Hey, good shit, Tanjiro. You got a hit on him. Rice balls and pickle plums. <laughs> Yo, visual on that sword right there. Has he slept though? Like he hadn't he hadn't eaten or drank in like five days, apart from the rainwater. Did he sleep? Oh shit, he doesn't want to break it. Use the back of your sword. Oh, let's go. Strike like you're going for the kill. Oh, that dodge! Give him a haircut! Oh shit, did he lop off his head? Oh shit, he actually took his head off. What? Oh. Ooh! Yo, this is like some like ancient sword or something. This sword's gonna be hard. Is this gonna be Tanjiro's new sword? Right, so that was season three, episode two of Demon Slayer. Um, that was another very, very good episode. 
Uh, I really enjoyed the comedy there, and it was nice to see Tandro's kind of speech. Uh, getting the to convince that kid that don't give up now you'll be able to, you'll be able to get to the point one day where you can fix repair and make a new one of these as well um i really like that love the motivation and uh, the mist hasher is kind of a dick he ha he was doing that for good reason obviously he's the like he's the front line against you know the upper moons and all the demons really um moves on as well of course but, like, he really could have gone about it in a better way. <laughs> like, he could have been a bit nicer about that because it's a kid. Obviously, that that's what the training dummy is there for. It's to, you know, train swordsman and Tashira. But, like, damn, damn, bro. You could have been nicer. Um, but, yeah, overall, a very good episode. And I'm definitely looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day. And peace out.